TFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Del Rey Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update, and currently have a slightly mixed bag out here. That mix coming from the Dow, which is up 16 points. Otherwise, all the other U.S. indices trading to the downside. The S&P up 32 points at 7 tenths percent, 1 and 6 tenths for the NASDAQ 100, 233. Russell is up 8 tenths, 16 points. Semis are down nearly 2 percent, or 59 points. Train is up 47 points. You've got gold down $9. Silver's off 37 cents. Lights recruiters up a buck, 105. 524 is the print there. Let's go spend a little bit of time with our nine panel market update chart. We begin by taking a look at the ES mini upper left hand side. So we know the bottom of its daily profile. Uh, is a resistance level. Price has tried to uh, deal with that for the last four trading sessions and it has been unable to. Today's high is 44.55. The uh, bottom of that uh, daily profile is 44.53. So that's a key resistance level. Now, if price can regain that, then that suggests a move higher. But that's not the message right now. The spot volatility index, that's the center panel, is trading below its 50-day exponential moving average. So it suggests a sideways to higher move inside the S&P 500. The NQ also struggling at the bottom of its daily profile. That's at the 14102, uh, I'm sorry, 1412 level. And uh, today's high was, uh, looking at today, yeah, today. Oh, I'm sorry. The 14802. 14. Stevie's got to get it straight out here. That's the center that is trading into it, the 14276 level. Nonetheless, uh, price is um, uh, not sure where we're going to go with the NQ. I know where we're going to go with that. We're going to take a look at that during the Trader's Ed show. With regard to the U.S. dollar index, yesterday generated a bearish signal, which was a rose momentum indicator top. Uh, you got a new profile that is attempting to form. And if price can close above yesterday's high inside the U.S. dollar, that will negate that topping signal. That high is 100.51. Gold? pulls back uh, tests the uh, it's above the top of its daily profile been above that for four days that is suggested to move up to 2022 silver even though it's pulling back it's above the top of its daily profiles it's suggested to move to 2695 light sweet crude closed above the top of its daily profile yesterday trading above it again today that suggests higher price for light sweet crude natural gas continued negated on monday negated its td9 count top suggests it wants to add higher the 30-year treasury is trading below the bottom of support the support being its daily profile. When it closes below that, it says and that is 14201. That says low prices. Folks, thank you for the trader since you'll be up to start your Thursday. Have a terrific one. I look forward to seeing you again on Monday, one o'clock sharp. Take care.